Hello everyone, my name is Fly, and we're gonna do a quickie unboxing of the Adoric 3-in-1 Vegetable Chopper. As said in other videos, I'm a huge fan of the Adoric brand. I have electronics by them, I have a brand new shower head that is wonderful by them, and I've wanted a vegetable chopper for a long, long, long time. I, I'm gonna sound like an infomercial, but it's true. I hate chopping vegetables, and I cook every single day without fail almost. And I'm always using, I use pretty much onions, peppers, mushrooms, carrots, broccoli, uh, spinach, kale, and then sometimes I'll add in other things, but those are the seven main things I use across the board in my meals. And I, I, I hate, hate chopping vegetables. I will, uh, if I have to, I'll bring my roommate into the video and he can attest to how much I detest chopping vegetables. So I hoped that getting this would help me out. So I wanted to show it to everyone at home. Okay, I'll turn the lights down a little bit for you so you can see a little better, but there it is. This is just a quickie unboxing. I'm going to do a video at the end of this on my phone where I will be filming myself actually using this. This is just to unbox it and show it to you really quickly. Inside we get, that's it. So this is the actual chopper here. Okay, we have the... This does have a very distinctive plastic smell, just so you know. And then there's the square chopper, the bigger square chopper, and then here. I don't see any instructions, but I honestly don't think it is rocket science. So... <laughs> Go ahead and unwrap this. And yeah, this just fits on here like that, so not too complicated. It does kind of come up, so be careful. And then I'm assuming all you do is... Because we have, like, this is more... Does this, come, this should come off. Okay. There we go. Okay, so the problem I was having is these are clips here, a clip here and a clip here. The bottom bits here clip into them and I had to undo them one at a time while pulling up. There's probably a much easier way to do that and I will have to watch some videos on how to uh, use a chopper because apparently I'm making it possibly more complicated than it has to be. And then you just pop the new one in like so, there's a little holes here and here for the end bits that pop out and then there's little things here and here where they snap in yeah getting it in easy super easy getting out was way easier this time too <laughs> i think this one might have just been really really jammed in there since it was the first one in so we're going to ignore that we're going to try the third one so if you have problems with the first one with the jaggedy edges it might be because it was already in there when you got the chopper, so maybe it's just been in there so long it's kind of set. And it's super cold. This was outside in the cold for about six hours earlier. So it probably, it also could have contracted being it's plastic and metal. Not making excuses for it, just saying this could want to happen. Blah, 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 blah. Okay, so the little things go face down and like so. And then you just put that on there and you just put whatever you want to. I would like if there was a like a lock mechanism here, so when you put it on, it locked in place. Because this is just just kind of goes all over. So kind of just it's just not very don't like that very much. But that's just me kind of being picky. There are little green feet at the bottom to protect the surface. So yeah, I would ask maybe some kind of like like clip here maybe and a clip here you can just kind of clip it on that way when it's on you just and then you just unclip it and it pops off something like that or maybe even like a button lever they press and it just pops up you know but you just put whatever attachment you want in and put your offending item because nightmare to chop and then just pow when you have magically chopped things in the bottom. We are going to do a short video following this 
which will be right after now for video time for you, but it'll probably be in a day or two in real time. Stay tuned for part two of this video where I actually put this to use, so stay tuned for that. So, so far this has been the unboxing and showing off of the Adoric 3-in-1 vegetable chopper. Stay tuned for part two.